it is important for women to be involved in math and science if they're interested in it because there is still kind of a shortage of women in the scientific fields and it is becoming closer to equal um, as the years go on but there still are fewer women and that's frustrating because there's not really any evidence that men are better at science or math um, it's just that that's the way it's been for so long that it kind of discourages women and so I feel like it's important that women if they are passionate about it that they do get involved and they do pursue it and not feel like they're not wanted in the sciences or and not feel like they're not good enough because that's not true and I feel like they do have a lot to offer. I don't necessarily have like a one certain inspirational female who I've been looking up to my whole life but there is another woman in the lab that I work in, Christine, and we're both the only two girls in there and she has been through like grad school and gotten her master's and everything so she knows I mean especially I don't want to be like at her age or whatever but I mean at her age she knows what it was like to go through all the science field when women were just getting into it. So it's nice to have her to look up to and to see that I'm in a really good position being a woman in the field that I'm in. It seems like it's a lot better than it was. <laughs> so I mean, things are moving in the right direction for women in science. And, um, and yeah, I mean, I, I do feel like I get to be a role model for my girls and they're re they think science is really cool and they're really into it and they haven't thought like oh girls don't do that or girls can't do that there seem to be a lot of women in science now I don't want you know to lose my place <laughs> in the program but, <laughs> but it seems to be going well so I feel I don't feel intimidated or afraid about you know looking for jobs as a woman. I don't think I really feel underrepresented. I mean, having it drawn to my attention, kind of looking around, it is noticeable that there are far more men than women in the science field, but I don't feel as if that poses a challenge to me in any way. It's just important because you need to know all of your options in life in general. You shouldn't just be like, well, you know, I want to be a mom, but, you know, that's perfectly fine. I want to be a mom, but you need to see other avenues like science isn't I don't want to say science is easy but it's not hard it's just as hard as any other job so if you like it then you should do it you shouldn't be um discouraged because anybody tells you you can't do something just because you're a woman because it's not true. Both my genetics professors this semester are women and they're great and um brilliant and funny and successful. Just actually up close and personal seeing women do science is just great. I personally look at um, the chancellor and I think, wow, look at her. She's a woman, she's uh, African-American, and she looks like me. And it's really exciting to just, I can definitely tell you it's a big difference to see her. Um, it strikes a certain chord with me when I just when I see her up there doing the things that she's doing, and it makes me realize it's not always just a, it's not it's never about your outward appearance. It's what you know, and it's what um, you can contribute to um, the whatever it is that you're involved in. It's all about your mind, and not necessarily how you look. And seeing her there just really reinforces that, and it shows me that I can do anything that I really want to do in this life.